Jennifer Lawrence called the hacking of her personal photos a sex crime in an interview with Vanity Fair released Tuesday. Hours later, someone made one of those photos her Wikipedia page picture. Jezebel has screenshots, though of course they're blurred. This happened Tuesday night. The outlet explains Lawrence's page is semi-protected, which means that in order to edit it, you have to be a registered member of Wikipedia. But it appears someone created a false account to be able to make the changes. And administrators had the page changed back within about 20 minutes. On Tuesday, Lawrence's silence on the August nude photo hack was finally broken when Vanity Fair published its cover story with her. In it, the Oscar winner called the hack a sex crime and said, It's my body and it should be my choice, and the fact that it is not my choice is absolutely disgusting. So, following that declaration by posting those personal, naked photos to her Wikipedia page, a page that represents who she is and summarizes her life and achievements, posting those photos as the photos that define her? The message sent here is that Lawrence doesn't matter as a person, that her choices don't matter, that what matters is her body. Refinery29 points out the move to put the photos on her Wikipedia page is similar to what happened to Emma Watson after she spoke out about feminism for the United Nations. An online group said it would leak nude photos of Watson in response to that speech. It turned out the group never intended to carry out the threat, but it still sent a message that threatening women with exposing their bodies is okay. The FBI is investigating the August iCloud hack. Personal, private photos of Lawrence and multiple other female celebrities were distributed throughout the world. For Newsy, I'm Lauren Zima.